Church, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Church, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is Brother Chine Edu Sydney. That's right. I am here to testify the goodness of God upon me and my family. That's right. I want to thank God for his divine protection. I want to thank God because he is the pillar that holds my life. That's right. My life belongs to our Lord Jesus Christ. Sure. By now, I would have been a dead person. But God said no to my enemies. God said no. It all started early this year. I traveled last year, December, for the holiday and for a family deliverance in our family. We did the family deliverance and we had a family meeting, kindred meeting. That's right. I remember that day when I walked into that hall, one of my wicked uncles, hmm. immediately he saw me, he started making some incantations, uh -huh. some divinations, started, pour, um, started making some libation, pouring wine on the floor and calling our great-grandfathers and our ancestors mm -hmm. to pursue him, not me. And when he was doing that, I was looking at him and I was smiling That's because right. I know the grace of God that is upon me. He knows the grace of God that is upon him. In Brother Assembly Church, there is grace. There is grace, so. There is God's protection. Sure. So when he was doing that, I was just smiling because I know that all that he was doing will return back to him, not me. After the family deliverance, I remember that day, the following morning, our first brother, as I was about to travel back to Lagos, our first brother came to bid me uh, by. And he started saying that he had a very terrifying dream. That in his dream, he saw about four giants. They used net and covered him. I was trying to strike him to death. Hmm. It was just last breath, last strength that he was able to wake up from the dream. And to us, we thought that it was a victory. But it wasn't a victory. So I started living for Lagos that day. When I got to Ijabode, I don't know what happened. But all I noticed was that the, my car, immediately the car behind, in front of me, immediately matched break all of a sudden. And because I was on a speed, I tried to swerve left, right? There was a trailer beside me, hmm. so I couldn't swerve my right side. The option was to hit the vehicle in my front. And that was how I had a very fatal accident. Hey. But what happened? Immediately I hit the car. I that came out. Car. That is the that car. Is the car. That is the car. We all came out from the car without any without scratch. Without any scratch. Only God can do this. So that is the car. Only God can do this. Hey, hey. The same day, the following day, I started receiving calls from my village that hey. they had, that I had an accident, that I died. Chineke. The rumor went to the village. You are people, undiable. People started rumoring that, if some people will call me and say, ah, Chine, look at what I had, oh. I said, but I am still alive. I'm the one talking to you. Is it ghost? All right. What next? Still on that shock, still on that shock of that accident, less than a week or less than two weeks, I had another bad news. Hmm. And that was the death of my first brother that hmm. came back from Europe. Jesus. He did, nothing happened to him. Jesus. But he just died. Hmm. Okay, we prepared and went for the burial. After the burial, I did, this time around, I didn't go with any car because I was still in shock. I was still afraid. When I was coming back from the burial, 
in the bus that I entered, there was another fatal accident. Another fatal accident again, but he's undiable now. But I'm undiable. Undiable. So the tire of the uh, the tire of the bus, the back the back tire just broke, <laughs> and it was flying as if something is pursuing it, and that was how the vehicle. Everybody started shouting. In, inside the car was like, God, is that the way I will go? Something was pursuing the tire too. But what happened today? I am alive. He's alive. Even after something pursued the tire of the bus, he's alive. He's alive. Our wicked uncles, they have tried all their possible means to eliminate me. It would say in my village, they have tagged me a name that I'm an occultic person, but I'm not an occultic person. I know what I have. It is the grace of God in this church, brother That's assembly. Right. That's right. He's so, yes. please, uh, my brethren, I would like you just to stand up and shout seven hallelujah for our Lord Jesus Christ. It's undiable. And if you know that you too, you are undiable. Seven hallelujah. Let us go. Hallelujah. Two. Hallelujah. Three. Hallelujah. Four. Hallelujah. Five. Hallelujah. Six. Hallelujah. Finally. Hallelujah. Thank you. None of you will die, cockroach death. Nobody under the sound of this testimony will die, cockroach death. Because he did not die, you will not die, cockroach death. You will not die by the wish of your enemies. You will not die by the wish of any man. They will pursue you, they will not get you. The Lord will keep you alive because you are His own. You will not die. Only God can do this. The Lord sustained His life. 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 somebody you are undiable you are undiable you are undiable undiable dire no no not undiable liver she <laughs> 